right, so something real quick I wanted to just touch up. I bought this short stub antenna off of Amazon, I believe, or eBay, and it just lost its color, the anodized color. So I'm just going to take it off and paint it. I'm going to just sand this part down and paint it with like a epoxy gloss black. So there's the antenna just on a wire. What I'm using is the PJ1 Fast Black. This is more for like motorcycles for uh, the covers, engine covers and stuff like that. That's a epoxy, porcelain hard epoxy paint, gloss black. I'm gonna put about three coats onto here. All right guys, so the short stub antenna is fully dry with the epoxy gloss black paint and it looks very nice I did put on the three little o-rings that are on there and now it's not such an eyesore looking like raw aluminum just sitting there I do still need to do the windshield wiper arms right here it's going to be done with the same black epoxy paint so once everything comes together it's going to look very nice now that this little piece is finished the next thing I want to work on is I did purchase some carbon fiber mirror covers for the truck here it's just an overlay and as you guys can see on the video here I did already do a ceramic coating on these mirror covers one coat of the G-Technic crystal light serum and then two coats of the G-Technic exo coating that just gives it the additional protection and wetness that a lot of people are looking for on these ceramic coatings now that the ceramic coating is fully done, it has already been done for about 24 hours. I'm going to show you guys them right now. So here is the covers right here guys. It has one coat of the crystal serum light and two coats of the EXO coating. They look very nice man. Let's see if I show you a shot in the sun real quick. And there it is in the sunlight. Very clean. I'm pretty excited to put these on the truck. I know it's just going to give it that extra pop. And since I already have the carbon fiber drive shaft, this will just be a hint of what's underneath it. I already did scrub down the mirrors here just with some uh, dish soap just to get any of the loose dirt off of it. Next thing I'm going to do is use the mother's clay bar just to get any residual um, stuff off of it. You know, they are sticking out so they get hit with a lot of dirt and rocks. So just want to make sure to go ahead and cleanse the surface before I use the 3M tape to hold this on. I'm just going to put 3M tape on the backing of this here. Here you can see the carbon and just along the edges I'm going to use that 3M tape here. You could just buy this at your AutoZone Advance whatever. The exterior attachment tape and this is just like a quarter inch thick. So let me go ahead and get with the clay bar real quick. Alright so the covers are all prepped up. I'm just got to open up the tape and then we'll start laying this down. Made that. The 3M tape is on there. It's pretty nice if you ask me. Going to take these inside ones off first. Those inside ones are off. I'm just going to slightly start this other one just so it's hanging off. And then once it's completely on, I'm going to just slide that one right off. So it's just slightly off there. Going to make sure it hangs down. And here goes nothing. So that is on there. Had a little bit of trouble. But I mean, it's straight, man taking a quick look at this it's looking clean I know you can't really see it like in person but this thing is clean man right now I know the sun is going down but take a look at that
So there you have it guys, I put on the carbon fiber mirror covers and painted the short stub antenna. The short stub antenna, it just really hides the look of the antenna. Before when it was faded, people started asking me and they're like, hey, did you switch out the antenna? You switched it over from the stock antenna? It's like, no, nah, it's always been that same antenna, but now you're noticing it because of the raw aluminum look. Well, I got that taken care of, it just seamlessly goes along with the truck. And then of course, put on the carbon fiber mirror covers. Guys, if you haven't already, check out Special Carbon Fiber. I know they have some pieces that they make for Del Sol's, Civics, F-150s, uh, Eclipse, and probably some other cars in there that I am didn't even look through. If you guys want to go ahead and check them out, check them out. They got pretty reasonable prices to me for handmade carbon fiber pieces. So it's definitely going to make you stand out from the rest on your vehicle. And I definitely am going to purchase some more pieces in the future. As far as for the pieces on the truck, it really adds that detail, it adds that little bit of pop. A lot of times on these cars that you guys are amazed by, you're amazed by the detail work. It's the detail work that makes everything come together. So that's why you guys see me always focusing on the details is because that's what majority of working on cars is, is details. Hopefully you guys like this video. Comment down below if you have any questions of course if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notifications as well hopefully you guys like the video give me a big thumbs up down below and as always guys I'm gonna have to catch you on the next one mate.